These are definitely the three most terrifying animal experiments in human history, especially the last one, which unbelievably used one's own biological son and an animal for the experiment. The first one is the gorilla head transplant experiment. In 1970, an American doctor removed the head of one gorilla and transplanted the head of another gorilla, spending a great effort to connect and sew all the neck tissues. Surprisingly, this gorilla miraculously survived, and its consciousness, vision, and hearing all returned to normal. Although this experiment achieved significant results, due to the inability of the spinal connection to heal, the body could not move, so the gorilla died within a few days. The second, the two-headed dog experiment. In 1954, Soviet scientist Vladimir cut open the upper body of a small dog and then transplanted it onto another large dog, connecting their blood vessels and nerves. Astonishingly, both dog heads could breathe independently and respond. This provided significant assistance for future human organ transplantation technology in the medical field. But regrettably, this two-headed dog only survived for 29 days before showing signs of bodily rejection and ultimately gave its life for science. The body was preserved as a specimen and donated to the History Museum. The third, Kellogg experiment. Kellogg was an extremely crazy American psychologist. To test whether a chimpanzee could integrate into human life, he actually raised his 10-month-old son Donald and a 7-month-old chimpanzee named Gua, together with no differences in care. In the following days, Gua and Donald would eat, sleep, and play together. And Gua clearly showed a strong ability to learn, except for could not speak. She could do basically everything a one-year-old child could do. In contrast, Donald fared quite poorly. Not only did he fail to learn human behaviors, but his behavior also increasingly resembled that of a chimpanzee. Realizing the seriousness of the situation, the Kelloggs immediately stopped the experiment. This farce ultimately came to an absurd end after nine months, and the chimpanzee Gua was sent back to the research center.